If you're already subscribed, welcome back. In today's video, I'm just going to show you guys another protective style. So I did a protective style video a couple weeks back and that video seemed to have taken off really fast and I had a lot of great response with that video, a lot of thumbs up. So thank y'all that watched and gave it a thumbs up. So I figured let me do another one, let me tinker around with some other styles. So um, I'm not going to do three, I'm just going to do one in this video. So again, I'm just going to bring just another basic simple style uh, for short to medium length hair. And this is a style that I've been working on. It's, it's nothing fancy. It's just something new that I tried and I liked it. So I said, okay, I can switch it up and try this style for a little while. So I just want to bring that to you guys and show you the new protective style that I'm going to do. Some parts of the video, it may be a little hard to see what I'm trying to do. But ultimately, I'm just going to take the sides of my hair as far as the back portion. Uh, just in case you can't see. And I'm going to just twist them, just a regular twist all the way back into like two ponytails. And then I'm just going to twist them slightly together and tuck them towards my hair. I'm just going to tuck and fold it and then pin um, pin with a bobby pin. And it's going to basically look like a, a rounded twist, uh, like a crown in the back of my hair. Try to explain it. It's kind of difficult. You just have to see it. Um, hopefully you can follow along with what I'm trying to do. Before we get started, let me just show you some of the products that I'll be using for this protective style. So from the True by Made Beautiful, I'll be using the Moisturizing Styling Foam. I'm not going to use this foam for my entire hair. I'm just going to use it for just certain portions of my hair. Also to keep my hair nice and moisturized throughout the styling process because sometimes my hair does dry out, I will be using from the Jane Carter Solution the Revitalizing Leave-In Conditioner which is my favorite leave-in conditioner. For my stylers, I'll be using the Curl Defining Jelly also from the True by Made Beautiful. And also I'm going to be using these two little babies. So the first one is from Also Inspired by Made Beautiful, the Curly Temple Balm as well as from the True Hydrating Edge Control. I really like both of these products, so I don't know which one I'm going to use, so I'm just going to use them both. And for my styling tools, I got my Tangle Teaser, my smoothing brush, a comb, and some bobby pins. So to prep my hair for this protective style, my hair is already freshly washed and cleansed already. I did that off camera, so my hair is nice and clean. You always want to start out on clean hair if possible when you're doing any type of styling on your hair because you don't want to add more products on top of products that's already in your hair. But nevertheless, we're going to make this a short video. So without further ado, let's get started.
concludes the video. First of all, I just want to say I apologize for the lighting. I just had a major storm go through. It just went completely dark, so I lost a lot of lighting. So I was adjusting my lighting. I had to turn on the kitchen light. It's trying to get some lighting in here, so I apologize for the bad lighting, but this is what happens when you film with natural lighting. You just don't know how the clouds are going to move, the sun going in and out, and then, of course, a huge storm comes over and everything is just completely dark in here. I hope you guys enjoyed this protective style that I did for you. Again, this is the twist and tuck uh, protective style, so I hope you like it. I tried to do the best I could in the back. I hope it turned out good. I can't really see, but I hope it turned out really well. But I just wanted to show you guys just the gist of this hairstyle so you could try it on your own. I really had fun making this video for you guys. I have fun making every video that I do for you guys. But I do like these protective styles. I like to switch it up, try something different. And I like it. I think it's cute, very sleek. And you can dress it up, dress it down. And you can put some jewels with it if you like. I just did some gold bobby pins just on the side there just for a little decorative touch to it. But you can use whatever little decorative jewels you want to. I hope you enjoy yet another protective style that I did. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's just Janine, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.